If you're gonna lead people somewhere, then you need a clear vision. Otherwise, it's a bit like Jesus warned the Pharisees. If a blind man leads a blind man, they're both gonna fall into a pit. Vision is crucial, powerful, explosive. You need to think of it as dynamite for leadership. Vision is the secret ingredient that gets things moving, rolling, happening around the place. I like the definition of vision as an action-inspiring picture of the future. You can be sure that if there's no action stirred up, or motivation inspired among your team, then there's simply no vision. Vision is the bomb. I heard it once said the lead sled dog gets the best view. Now dogs are pretty hard workers, so I'm pretty sure this doesn't mean he stops to admire the scenery. What it means is that the lead dog can see where the slips and ice traps are ahead to guide his pack safely and speedily to their destination. It's not about being up the front, but seeing where to go in order to take your team and life-saving equipment with you. If you're a lead sled dog, true, you do have the best view. But the reason for that view is because you're leading a rescue mission through wild territory, not because you're competing for the prize of coolest youth group in town. If you're thinking about becoming a leader in ministry, this is worth pausing to emphasize. You want a vision? Here's a vision. Your mission is to save lives, not play games. Your mission is to be the church, not play church. Your mission is to be salt, not fairy floss. Now game nights and mosh pits and Nerf gun fights and movie marathons are awesome. And there's gonna be plenty of those along the way. But it cannot be overestimated how essential it is to get your focus right from the start. The church is called to be the hands and feet of Jesus on the earth. And your role as a leader in the church is to lead people to Him so they can be that too.